So it looks like things may not be as good between Beyonce and Megan as we've been thinking this whole time. Because they just got into it after people started speculating that Beyonce may have seemingly insinuated that Megan is a raging drunk. Beyonce fueled these allegations herself when she failed to show her support for Megan at this year's BET Awards, even though she didn't hesitate to show the other girls love. This was definitely not something that any of us were expecting, because as far as we know, Beyonce and Megan were cool. I mean, Beyonce has been supporting Megan's career right from the start, and even helped her bag her first number one hit and a Grammy. So her throwing shade at Meg for an alcohol addiction was the last thing on anybody's mind. Now, for those of y'all who didn't know, Megan revealed a little over a month ago that she was about to release her own tequila brand called Chicas. She posted this video of her herself serve and body while holding the bottle with a caption that said, Chicago hotties, your chicas is ready. Y'all get to have the first exclusive taste of my new tequila dropping soon. A lot of people praised her at the time for getting in her bag and making major moves like this. In a recent interview she just had with Shannon Sharp, Meg revealed that it was actually Beyonce who told her to start her tequila brand. Apparently, she and Meg were hanging out when Beyonce realized that Meg was taking an overwhelming amount of alcohol. So she told her to start her own tequila brand since she already loves drinking it all the time. With how happy Meg looked when she said this, it's obvious that she thought Beyonce was giving her business advice. And I mean, when you think about it, it does in fact sound like business advice because everyone knows Meg loves herself some alcohol. At the start of her career, she was known for making people drive the boat whenever they party with her and even branded herself as the cognac queen. So alcohol has been a part of her brand from the start. However, some people claim that Beyonce's comment was actually a backhanded compliment, and this was her way of telling Meg to put the bottle down and maybe check herself into a rehab to fix her alcohol addiction. One person said, Honestly, Beyonce being a Virgo could have been a shady remark, honestly. If you know them, then you know them Virgos quick with an underhanded one. Another person said, Pressuring an alcoholic into promoting their own alcohol is devious behavior. Now, the reason the reason why people are so triggered with the possibility of Beyonce's comment being shady is because Megan has not had a great relationship with alcohol. She even admitted some time ago that the reason why she started drinking so much was to cope with her parents passing because she didn't know how to handle the pain very well and drinking was the only way that she was able to cope with it. Not only that, but alcohol was a major contributing factor in her case with Tory Lanez. It was reported that all of them was drunk as hell the night she got and this led to them not even remembering some of the details from that night when they gave the police report. But see, this wasn't the only thing that had people speculating that Beyonce didn't like Megan. On the night of the BET Awards, people were shocked when Beyonce reposted Victoria Monet and Tiana Taylor's performance on her IG story. This was a big deal because this is the first time Beyonce has ever reposted her performance on her Instagram. Both Victoria and Tiana were shocked as all of us were because they weren't expecting this to happen either. Tiana said on her IG, and that's Queen B, I'm gagging. Victoria Monet, get in here now. Victoria also took to her IG to show her appreciation when she said, oh my God, I am screaming. What? Cannot gasp air. I am unwell, holy ish. I did not expect to pass out today, gagged completely. Beyonce, we love you. The original bad gal. I will forever honor you. Unfortunately for Meg, she couldn't really join in on the excitement because people noticed that Beyonce didn't bother to post her performance at all, even though she and Glow shut the place down with their performance. Now, I personally don't think this means much of anything, but a whole lot of people on the internet are speculating that these things might be signs that Beyonce and Megan are probably having major issues behind the scenes that we don't know about. People also drag Beyonce for filth for even daring to suggest that Megan has a tequila brand when she knows the girl has an alcohol problem. That's like telling a kid to sell some 
broke and not expecting them to relapse. At least that's what people saying on social media. Cause one person said, if Meg's gonna be a raging unapologetic drunk, then she might as well be profiting from it. Can't believe Beyonce had to tell her that. This is how I know most of y'all be wasting her time. Another person said, so Beyonce, the one that gave Megan that terrible tequila advice, Shakes my head, lol. But now I want to know your thoughts. What do y'all think about Beyonce telling Megan to start this alcohol brand? And do y'all believe that Beyonce was really trying to be shady when she said it? Y'all been knew what to do. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget to click here to watch this other very messy video.